All right, beautiful people. So now that I've already taken care of Zane, it's now time to get into my little routine. Lately, I've been incorporating this new routine of mine, and it is the Teeny Blends. It's their 30-day detox plan. And this is how it looks. And thank you, Teeny Blends, for sponsoring this video. So, you guys, I did post a blog the other day letting you know that I was trying the Teeny Blends 30 Day Detox Plan. And I just want to come on here and tell you about my experience and how I've been liking it so far. You do get a Teeny Skinny Tea, which looks like this. And then also, you get the Teeny Colon, which is 15 tea bags. And it also comes with this detox calendar here. So you use this daily to, you know, stay on track and complete your 30 day detox plan. So as you can see, you do the skinny tea in the morning and then you do the colon um, tea bag at night and you do that every other night. The purpose of the detox plan is not to make you lose weight or get you skinny. It's not a quick fix. Um, it is really something to improve your gut health. And that's what I feel about all of Teeny Blends products. Um, you guys know that I've been working with Teeny Blends for a while now and not only do they have things for your wellness they do have skincare products as well and i just feel like all of their products is just geared towards helping you improve your lifestyle to have more of a healthier lifestyle so like i mentioned the timmy blends 30 day detox plan is there to improve your gut health which a lot of people neglect all their lives you know what i mean like let's just be honest i know for me you want to do good you want to put good things into your body but sometimes you don't have the knowledge and then sometimes you don't have the time like i said the timmy blends do all the work for you in the back end so you don't have to worry about researching and wondering if you're doing this right or that right it's, they're doing it for you. So it consists of two easy steps and it's even realistic for people who have the most busiest schedules. I know for me, having a dog between work and collaborations, things like that, it just gets so busy. And I love it because it's not requiring a lot of my time. Like everyone, I'm human. I eat things that are unhealthy sometimes, um, such as like pizza, wings, you know, cheat meals or whatever. And a lot of people don't realize that, you know, just eating unhealthy can really affect how your body works. So if you ever felt like bloated, or if you have like low energy then it is time for a detox so because of my low energy and me eating unhealthy i've been doing this detox plan for more than two weeks now and it's just such a good cleanse to feel good um i personally do not feel bloated and my energy has increased and that's one thing that i noticed about teeny blend products because like i stated i've done videos with them in the past you guys know i've tried other products and i'll always get that boost of energy and i'm just like okay like this is what i need in my life so it's like it becomes like a lifestyle it's honestly just to reset and refresh your body in just these two simple steps this is just perfect for everyone's lifestyle no matter where you're at in your wellness journey if you are interested in the teeny blends 30 day detox plan there will be a link down below you can also use my code eyes on eight and you will receive 20 percent off your purchase before we get to planning and carving out our day i do need to make up my bed i think making up your bed is really essential every morning um it just prevents you from getting back into bed one but also just helps helps you become a little bit more productive throughout the day it already gets you going you're already moving around so I love making up my bed every morning sometimes I do slip up but more than likely I'm making up my bed every morning it's the end of the weekend but I still wanna turn up Yeah, I still wanna turn up All I want is to go again But you ain't picking your phone up Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day Let me take you away All I need is just saying yeah, 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 yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder I also like to spray this Endless Weekend spray from, it's a room spray by Bath and Body Works. Oh my gosh, like. spray throughout the room. It just really, really makes it smell so good. So yeah, I'm about to go and sit on my balcony and just plan. Don't be so hard to reach. Just pick up your phone. Tell me where you'll be. Cause I gotta know. Let me know when you're ready. Cause I made reservations Too many invitations And the last night was heavy. heavy I need communication Tell me where's your location 
used to talk 24-7 Every other second Just to make sure we were up to date Now it's closer to 11 And I ain't hearing nothing I just need to know that you're okay Alright you guys, so I'm actually in my office slash studio room and I am going to run back to my manager for any new collaborations that's coming up this coming month. Don't be so hard to reach, just pick up your phone, tell me where you be, cause I gotta know. All right, hello you guys. Today is July 8th. Oh, this is so hot. Today is July 8th and it's almost 6.30. I just got back in from like walking Zane. It's Thursday, but honestly guys, I've really just been chilling. I haven't been doing anything. Um, but just chilling, watching Manifest. I finished watching um, Manifest. I got to season three. Um, I got to season three. So that was good. But right now, since I just got back from Walking Zane, I'm making this food a little bit early because I'm actually going to an event that my apartment complex is having today. I'm really interested in it, so I'm going to head down there and just see what they're talking about. Come on, come eat. I actually got two packages here. I got a pretty little thing package. Um, it's not sponsored or anything. I'm just going to, um, what I'm going to do. I'm just going to do like a try on haul when I come back because the event starts in literally 40 minutes, so I need to get down there. And then, and then I also got another package, which I can just go ahead and show you guys that right away. I'm hoping this is what I asked for. This is my first time like ordering from the company. So I got, <laughs> I got the Yeezy uh, phone runners. I know a lot of people like, a lot of people say they're ugly, you know, all types of stuff or whatever, but I think they're cute and I'm hoping that I can fit them. Oh, I can. So my feet are so ashy. I hate to show you guys. So these are what they look like. I personally think they're super cute. Um, Yeah, sorry y'all, my feet are ashy. So I got these shoes from goat and it says they're verified and everything i did have to pay a little bit more than what i wanted to pay especially considering like how much more i had to pay um considering like uh what i was gonna say yeah these are definitely really comfortable oh i like these but anyway yeah i had to pay a little bit more than what i wanted to pay i could feel a little you know a little bump on it but um, yeah, I had to pay more than I wanted to pay because you know how it is whenever you have to go through like a second hand website or whatever it's called. Um, I need shoes for a long, long time. I went ahead and did. I tried to wait, okay? But I didn't see them coming out with another one of these. I think they're coming out with another color, but not this specific color. And I really wanted this color because it's very universal. Um, but yeah, I had to pay a little bit more that I didn't, I didn't want to, but um, hopefully they verify, shoot. But they look so nice, they feel really, really good. Um, I love them. All right, but I'm gonna talk with you guys in a little bit. All right, you guys, oh my God. I can't wait to get in the bed. Um, but I made it back to my apartment. I've been back here for probably about three hours now. It's actually 1 a.m. in the morning. Look at this one o'clock in the freaking morning um so yeah it's 1 a.m in the morning but as promised i'm gonna do this like pretty little thing um haul for you guys <clears throat> ordered some stuff for vacation but i also have some weddings that i'm going to this month um so and actually one of them is next weekend so um 
what is it yeah one of them is next week next weekend so i just ordered some things that i could like possibly wear to a wedding anyway let me try this on so here's the first like outfit and all this will be linked down below if you're interested so i got this for a wedding fit um girl and don't pay attention because i am ashy and i ain't got time to put no lotion on it's like like i said it's after one in the morning but anyway, so uh, I got this for a wedding fit. It's a two-piece set, so it's like a corset top here. I love this color. Like, I really do like this color. And then um, I have this, like, drapey, like, skirt. It has, like, a little zipper on the side. And then, like I said, it just gives you this really dramatic, drapey, you know, effect. And then it has, like, a little split right here. You can kind of play around with it. So if you want the split a little bit more on the side, you can. Or in the front, it is what it is. Um, I really like this. I definitely see this as a nice um, wedding piece or whatever like a wedding guest piece i think it's so gorgeous um definitely would layer with a nice little necklace it does have here adjustable straps i will rate this probably like a eight out of ten because it's giving me you know like i like this the material is really good i i do have to say that the material is absolutely really nice but it's giving me <laughs> I don't know it's kind of giving me Christmas tree vibes or whatever <laughs> and Zane don't you do that you about to go to bed okay it's way past your bedtime but it's still so gorgeous and I do like the color I think it's just the structure of the skirt you know like at some point it was like the extra fabric wasn't needed but I see where it's like where it's going but it's it's really gorgeous so i can't wait to wear this i have two weddings to come up i have two weddings that's coming up so this is definitely an option all right so here's the next dress i think this dress is absolutely gorgeous like the style of the dress however this dress is going to be rated probably about a six out of ten um this is like a really okay not a six out of ten okay i don't want to say that it just really depends like for a wedding i'm gonna give it like a six out of ten um but for like any other event where i'm just stepping through like if i was going on a red carpet maybe okay um but there's just like a few things that i just don't get like at first of all the color is absolutely gorgeous against my complexion so i am here for it. i love it um it has like a little spaghetti strap and this like drape you know that like this one shoulder drape i can't explain it um it you know kind of cinches you in at the waist this uh, spaghetti strap does have adjustable straps and then also it has like a little zipper in the back now i don't know if my back too big <laughs> but this little zipper is not zipping up here in the back but you can't really tell you know what i mean like if i have my hair down you're not going to be able to see it and then again i'm ashy girl so don't pay attention but it does have big split here um it is just a very i don't know if i step back here you can see it you see how long it is beautiful beautiful and like this right here is a little bit too deep i know some people are gonna be like girl you knew what you was ordering before you ordered okay girl but i i don't know like i just feel like this is a little bit too deep i didn't think it was gonna be too deep but also if you want to get like tape you can like make it look decent you know what i mean so i don't think it's too bad and i've seen worse at a wedding <laughs> to be honest or whatever like girl where's you going you know type of thing but the, the 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 only thing that I have an issue with really is I would have to wear like some biker shorts or something underneath here um, because this is so like it is if I lift this up like it doesn't stop you know what I mean so it is very much exposed you know what I mean again gorgeous gorgeous dress i love this dress but it's just super duper exposed here and then also i mean this is supposed to be draped yes but i just kind of wish it was kind of like a little belt right here and i'm pretty sure if i wanted to i could put a little belt but i really want to keep like i want it to still be classy you know what i mean and this gives me classy vibes adding a belt just don't give me classy vibes or whatever so i wish this was like you know pinned right here because they're really just you see how it really snatches the waist in or whatever compared to this like it still gives you snatch vibes but it's a little bit more loose but this oh yes baby 
all right so here's the next wedding dress it doesn't work out for me i can't even like zip it up because it's just too tight in this area kind of like this little drape like if you can see it i don't know if you can catch the detail i'll try and like insert a picture of it as well so you can see like the vibe of it i would definitely like go up a size especially if you got like a uh, wider hips so yeah this is how that looks so that was all my wedding pieces. I only got like three. The rest of it is like vacay pieces um, for my upcoming trip. I got this here. It fits the vibe on where I'm going. Y'all will see where I'm going in like, you know, like I said, in a few weeks or whatever. Um, <clears throat> but um, I'm going with my best friend for her birthday. And this definitely fits the vibe on where I'm going. Um, I don't know, like it's just i love like i really love this style i love like the uh watercolor pastel yellow um vibe and even this dress is like super cute so i may still wear i would have to get some like boob tape because it is literally very exposed so i have to get something to really just keep this in but even with this like it's just a lot of extra material so i don't know how it would make this work so yeah i think this is cute um i would give it maybe like a seven a six or a seven out of ten all right you guys so here is like the next look hopefully you can see it um this is another vacay piece i really really do like this piece you guys know i'm here for like the two piece um sets here and you can wear this like off the shoulder if you would like to a real nice little piece or whatever but yeah this is just how it looks um, I don't really like the fit of the skirt on me. It definitely does fit, so I'm happy about that. I just don't like the fit of it because it just gives me like straight vibes. You know what I mean? And your girl wanna be straight like a Coke bottle, so I don't really know just yet, but I do know that I like this. It's definitely coming on a trip with me. And I'll give this like an eight. A nine, probably eight. Eight, eight, eight and a half. Uh, I repurchased these pants, but I got a bigger size. So I got like, this actually comes in a set. I got the button up shirt, but that's in the closet somewhere, girl. It's in my vacation box. So I got to get that, you know, later. But I got the um, button up shirt to match. Um, so I kept the shirt, but I sent the pants back and then I repurchased these. And I got these in a size US 8, which is a UK 12, I believe. Um, and they fit perfectly yes and they're even long enough you know what i mean they're just beach flares um and they are a little bit thin they could be a little bit see-through but not too much um but yes i love this let me stand back so you can see i know it's probably hard to see but girl work with me um so yeah this is how these look and i really like them so um so if you are interested in these pants i would say go up a size especially like if you have you know a little bit of hip or butt you're gonna be happy that you did you don't want it like too tight on you and i i don't want it too tight on me so yeah i am here for these cute so here's the next item that i got it is this long long line button up dress slash shirt you know what i mean um it is just a very just loose fitting. I just wanted something where I can just throw on, I can put slides on um, with it. If I wanted to, I can throw a belt on with it. And um, it's white, so where I'm going is gonna be very hot. So I love the fact that this is very lightweight. It's white, so it's not gonna um, attract too much heat. This is a step back, this is how it looks. And it has like the two slits here on the side. Like the rating <clears throat> with the pants, the quality could be better, but it's not horrible. Um, so I'll give the pants a nine, cause like I said, I have ordered them before. And and I just needed a bigger size. This, I'm gonna give this, like I said, it's just a plain little dress or whatever, so like an eight. All right, you guys, so here's the last item that I got. And I don't know, is this cheetah or leopard, girl? I don't be <laughs> remember, but it's this bodycon dress. It is super duper, like, gorgeous. It definitely fits the body well. I got this, again, for a vacay, just to, like, go out, you know, for, like, clubbing and stuff. You gotta have a club outfit. And I thought, you know, anytime I get, like, animal print, it just gives me very much, like playful so that's what like the vibe i'm going for um and like i said once you figure out like where i'm going you can be like yeah girl 
this fits perfectly i like it uh i need i don't have a brow on with this so i definitely need to put a brow on to you know make these girls look like they were just done okay per but you know don't pay me any mind but seriously i need to put a brow on with it and i think it'll definitely fill this area out really really nice um but it does not have adjustable straps which i just don't like because i like for things to have adjustable straps so i can definitely feel secure in this area but like i said once i put the brow on it's definitely going to you know enhance this area a little bit more for me and my liking it does have i don't know if you can see but this little lining underneath you see that Ugh, i think that is so gorgeous like that is just a nice little detail and honestly you guys i would just wear it like this like a simple necklace i'm not trying to do nothing too much because the dress is already doing it um and just a simple like heel like a black heel or something i could do like strappy heels or you know me girl <laughs> I'll probably do like a Perspex heel, but like black, you know what I mean? It definitely fits my body really well. And if your girl needed it to ew, twerk, she could if she wanted to, okay? But she ain't gotta do too much, okay? I can still look cute in class with a little clutch. So yeah, girl, that's it. All right, girls, so <laughs> it is literally 1.43, okay? 1.43 in the morning so i'm about to um go to bed i'm about to put zane to bed if you i don't know if you heard him snoring or not but he's like snoring he's like ready to go to bed you like i be in the, I, he be like i be in the bed this time like what you doing like i didn't have any issues with pretty little thing this time like the last time i ordered from pretty little thing for my um um before my Cabo trip like it was horrible like for me like i ended up sending like probably like more than half of the items back i'm very impressed with the pretty little thing items that i got so i would give this whole haul like all, out of all like out of everything i would probably give it like a solid eight the whole haul i got on the skims this is the new color but i forgot what this is called i think it's like iris i don't know what it's called so yeah zane is sleeping in his bed y'all y'all see those little dots in his head i really don't know like they're like raised I'm sorry, man. I know you sleep. Mommy about to take you to bed. But y'all see those little dots? Like, they're raised. I don't know. But the last time he had these little dots in his head, like, he was, like, allergic to something. And I think it was something that he was eating. But it's just, like, you see, bam, bam. And then th it's, like, a little roll, a little line of that. So, Yeah. I don't like that. I'm going to have, he goes to the vet next week for his shot. So I'm going to have them like, you know, look into that and see what's going on. But yeah, so I'm about to put him to bed because he's sleepy. He got a whole other bed, girl. This is, this is playtime bed, okay? His, he got a whole dog mattress in the room. Orthopedic girl, okay? Like dogs be living better than we do. All right. Good morning, you guys. Today is July 9th. It's like 122 or whatever. Um, I'm in the office. I got my coffee because you know me. <laughs> Y'all, it's so crazy because I used to like never drink coffee and now I drink coffee. But I like iced coffee and my coffee has to be like a certain type of way. You know what I mean? Like it got to be, you know, it got to have some flavor to it if that makes sense. Like it can't just be like straight coffee. My dad, he drinks straight black coffee. I don't know how he do it. He don't like none of that stuff. He drinks straight black coffee and I can't do it. But anyway, so I've been in the office for like a few hours now. I've been honestly, I've been in some meetings or whatever. And then um, I have this vlog that I need to edit. I don't have Zane today, so I'm happy about that. Um, so it gives me the opportunity just to kind of like, you know, do some work or whatever. I honestly need to like kind of um, finish cleaning up the kitchen. Like I cleaned up everything yesterday. I need to like mop. Um... And then I need to wash like some clothes and it's just nice to do it whenever Zane's not here. But honestly, I don't feel like doing anything. So that is going to be like my little struggle or whatever. I got this like vlog footage that I need to be editing. But again, I don't feel like doing anything. But um, I got to do what I got to do. Um, but yeah, so I just like, like I said, I just got out of the meeting or whatever. I actually need to schedule my nail appointment for whenever I go out of town. So I need to go ahead and do that right now. I just wanted to come in and check with y'all. I don't have much I want to do. I got to figure out like what I want to do to my hair whenever, um, 
I leave out of town. Like I said, my braids don't look bad. They still look like really good or whatever, but I know that I don't want the braids in because um, I just don't. I don't be keeping styles a long time. I know it's bad. All right, but yeah, I'm not doing anything. I just really wanted to check in with you guys. Like I said, I'm in the office today, so I'm just gonna be here for a while. It's still early, it's 1.30. Um, it's Friday, like I said, I don't have a thing, so I kinda wanna, oh no, oh no, like do my own little thing. Like I don't wanna be doing anything. But, I don't know, just yet. But just wanted to check in with you. <sighs> yeah. Good morning, my beautiful people. It is July 10th. It's almost 11 in the morning. I'm actually um, ready to go. I'm about to head to breakfast. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to vlog the breakfast or not. Um, but, you know, it's Saturday. I don't really have anything planned. It's like I'm on, like, you know, I'm on the verge of, like, I want to do something, but then I don't. But I'm just kind of going with the flow of today. Like, whatever happens, happens. You know what I mean? But I don't mind being lazy either but i'm ready no makeup or anything like that i'm gonna show you my outfit really quick it's just something real simple that i just kind of like threw together so i have on this like bodysuit here that i got from miss lola i got this like years ago um but yeah this little bodysuit here and then i got on this little skirt from um pretty little thing i just threw on like my sandals i gotta put my anklets on but these are my Aldo sandals. <laughs> I always have these on. Carry this little white bag here that I got from uh, Forever 21. So this is like the whole outfit. I head to breakfast, which is like I said, it's almost 11. So it's technically almost brunch time. Um, or it is brunch time. So I'm gonna head there and then whatever else happens throughout the day, I'll update y'all if I do anything. This is so freaking beautiful. Uh, I am in love. This is beautiful. Oh my god, fresh hydrangeas, like so pretty. this garden place in um, Charlotte it's called Black Hawk Garden Center so if you're ever in Charlotte Black Hawk Garden Center um, they just have some of like the most amazing flowers um, and just plants everything here so I love it it's just so beautiful it's like a dream like I would take pictures here you know but oh my god so gorgeous like even look at this like this is just so beautiful i cannot deal i'm just such a sucker for flowers and they have these hydrangea trees here 
or plants and they are literally like my favorite type of flowers like i'm always getting these hydrangeas like whenever i go to harris teat um and i just love them i love the different colors that they have as well um they said this is the original it says that i don't know what this one is but they also have some lavender hydrangeas and i'm just a fan of any color hydrangeas like they're so pretty like those are my favorite flowers but yeah this is gorgeous like girl this is not so beautiful and then they have a lot of different like statues that you can put in the yard and like fountains as well. So I love that. Just a really, really gorgeous, like gorgeous atmosphere. All right, we can go. Whenever my parents come into town, I'm gonna take them to this place because my dad, he loves, loves, loves working out in the yard. Yeah, he just really loves like landscaping. So he's gonna love this in here. And they have a main store. I'm gonna go in the main store as well. So the yeah, hydrangeas mm -hmm. right there, they will have to kind of go on like in shade. Heart, you want heart shade? Heart mm -hmm. okay. If they're in full sun all the time, they won't perform as well. Okay, okay. Um, and then we have the shrubs up there. And the majority of those will be full sun, but some are gonna be shade. Like we have this, the camellias over here. Okay. okay. Um, they're part shade. Uh, okay, I like yeah. the way y'all have that set up, okay. yeah. These are all the house plants. But y'all know me, y'all know I'm not doing no more house plants cause um, I just don't have that, <laughs> that green thumb. So I'm not even gonna worry about it. <laughs> but I still love flowers, you know what I mean? And just being in, in the space of flowers, for some reason it just like feels just, I don't know, just so relaxing. Oh, these are, I know these are like snake plants, right? It's a hot weather, so it's nice and like breezy. I like that, yes. Yeah, it is. <laughs> but oh, they have like little candles. Rabbits. <laughs> so cute in here. I don't know where we're at. We're in this like, I don't know. See, I like this here. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. the glow for me <laughs> um hey you guys today is sunday i think it's like july 11th if i'm not mistaken and i'm about to head to get something to eat um i did a little bit of work today uploaded my vlog um and just kind of like chill today for like a walk and um it's almost like 7 30 so i'm about to actually go and get some hibachi super hungry been Craving that for a while as well. I haven't had hibachi in so freaking long. So definitely want to go and get that. Um, so yeah, I don't know if I'm bringing my camera right now because like hibachi is boring. Like, you know what I mean? Like once you've seen one show, you don't see them all. You know what I mean? So I don't know if I'm gonna bring my camera, but I'm really just like real, real, real chill today, real relaxed. Um, I don't, I'm not dressed up or anything like that. Cause it's not like it's a special occasion. I get the camera. It's not like it's like a special occasion. I'm just going to get something to eat or whatever. All right, y'all. 
you might have a hard time seeing but here's the fit so i just have on um the same necklaces i always wear i really don't deviate from like the necklaces or my jewelry um so this one here is from like aldo this one here is from miss lola i got these so long ago um i have on my jbw watch uh, i know it's dark let's step over here in the light my child so I have my JBW watch. I've been loving this lately, so I've been wearing this a lot. This is the Crystal 34. You can also use my code if you want, girl. It's not sponsored, I have to always say that. It's just like to help you out if you do decide to buy. And that will be listed in the description box um, below. I have this little, little bracelet that I got from Miss Lola. Um, and then here's like the fit. Sorry if it's... Um, Sorry about the lighting. But anyway, so I have this uh, bodysuit that I got from Skims. I really love their bodysuits. Like, I am so here for their bodysuits. I have to get some long sleeve ones for uh, the winter, the fall and winter months. But like, ever since I've tried their bodysuits, I can never go back because it literally fits. It's super comfortable and stretchy, girl. Like, I ain't even lying. I got these little joggers on from, where did I get these from? J Lux label. Um, and these are really, really lightweight. As you can see, kind of got them a little bit high waisted. Got my LV purse here. And I am finally wearing, actually, let me put it down a little bit. I am finally wearing my Yeezys. First time wearing, I just got on some anklets. I know some people are gonna love them, some people are gonna hate them. That's fine, girl. I love them. And y'all, these are so freaking comfortable like oh my god i am so happy because these are so comfortable like i love them so again a real chill fit on the go and that's what we doing or whatever oh i didn't even show you what i bought yesterday hold on but you guys know i was in this home store in charlotte and they had these books and i'm just like might as well so i got this christian dior book here I'm like collecting books, even though I literally don't have any more. <laughs> I literally don't have no more space for these books, but I'm just collecting books for my house whenever I get my house. So I got this pretty Christian Dior book. Oh, so gorgeous. Can't wait to open it. I got this Chanel book here. I already got a Chanel book, but this one is completely different than the one that I got. Is it? Yeah. So I got this Chanel here. And this is like the cover. And this is the other Chanel that I got right here, Collections and Creations. So completely different and also smaller. But anyway, so yeah, got this here. And then the last book I got was the um, Louis Vuitton book. Um, it says it's the updated edition. I have a Louis Vuitton book, as you can see right here. The Louis Vuitton book was the most expensive. This was $125, I believe. This one was, I think, like $55. And this one also was $55. So yeah, these are all the books that I got. Anyway, I'm about to go eat and I'm gonna catch y'all later. Mm -hmm.